Good afternoon, Dan Barry. This is student meteorologist Dominic Mogstad here doing a virtual voiceover presentation today as I'm unable to make it into the studio because of the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. Now, through trial and error, I figured out that if I talk in the middle of changing a slide, it results in a weird audio glitch. So to correct that, I'll just take a brief pause before changing slides. Currently, we have some low-level cumulus clouds with some higher-level cirrus clouds giving that sun a milky appearance. This picture was taken in Danbury at 1.30 p.m. And we have some 71 degree temperatures out there with a 51 degree dew point, partly cloudy skies, and 49 percent humidity with those winds coming from the north at 10 to 15 miles an hour. So it does feel like a typical early fall day out there. Taking a look at the current visible satellite imagery, you can see those clouds uh, streaming in from the north northwest and the cold front, which has since pushed off of the coast, giving the Atlantic some clouds in association with that cold front. So that's why it does feel a little bit chillier today and a little less humid out there. Bringing it over to the current uh, surface map, sorry about that, we see that cold front that has since pushed off the coast and a high pressure which is moving over the area, ensuring no precipitation of any kind for the next couple of days at least, and mostly sunny to partly cloudy conditions for us. Now below that cold front, we see the approaching landfall of Hurricane Sally, which will affect the Gulf Coast region over the next couple of days. And to the east, we have the approaching landfall of Hurricane Paulette, which will impact the Bermuda Islands. Now, bringing it back to Danbury, for tonight, we'll have a low of 45 degrees. It will feel pretty cold out there, and we will have mostly clear skies thanks to that high-pressure system. For tomorrow, we'll have a high of 69 degrees with those winds from the northeast again at 5 to 10 miles an hour. It will be sunny, and it will feel pleasant out there. Another typical early fall day. And finally, taking you through the extended forecast, Tuesday after that 69 degree high, we'll have a 49 degree low. Uh, Wednesday warming up a little bit, 74 degrees and sunny with a 57 degree low. Thursday warming up even more, mostly cloudy conditions, but 77 degrees, 51 degree low. Then Friday, partly cloudy conditions, cooling off a bit at 64, and then really feeling that chill Friday night into Saturday morning where our temperatures will drop into the upper 30s, followed by Saturday starting off the weekend, 61 degrees and sunny. All right, thank you so much for watching. This has been student meteorologist Dominic Mogstad doing a virtual voiceover. Hopefully next week I can get back into the studio, but regardless, I hope you all have a safe, enjoyable week and Thank you so much for watching.